You pay for goods, you expect top quality. Consumerism 101. Please, scrapyards offer better quality than this. These girls know you're chipping faulty implants? You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> You're a sick fuck, know that? You looking for a friend? <laughs> I already see. told you. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be... Flattered, praised, patted, to feel like, like they deserve it. Of course. I can't remember each and every one. Even if it's Wind a- jittery soon as I mentioned her name. Don't try getting out of this. I know you remember her. I, I have a neurological condition. It's not easy living with ticks, really. I'd love to help, but if only I knew who you were talking about. Well, come on. Locks have got a low tolerance for scum like you. Right now, I'm the one thing standing between you and a particularly feisty and furious member of the gang. So tell me where Evelyn is? Or I'll let her talk to you. Poor girl. Tried to help her, I did. But as you can see, this isn't exactly a state-of-the-art facility. Mentioned you couldn't help her. Help her with what, exactly? If I only knew, I wager she'd be standing here, happy and smiling. Instruction register on her chip was burnt to a crisp. Tried replacing it. Nothing. Damage was caused by a netrunner using homebrewed malware. Sounds about right. Get to the point! The point? Ah, yes. Well, I haven't the faintest idea where she is. Enough of this bullshit! What'd you do to her, you freak? Now, either you put a muzzle on this creature, or put her down. It's impossible to have a conversation with her around. Forget why we're here. Don't talk to her like that. She insulted me. Look, the quicker you spill, the shorter you'll have to put up with us. Now, Evelyn Parker, where is she? Could very well be on her way to becoming the next underground brain dance, darling. That's all I know. What do you mean by underground? I don't know. I mean, I don't watch that sort of stuff. Snuff? XBDs? I told you I don't know. You sure about this? Four days I had her here. She was out cold in La La Land for practically every minute. It wasn't a slumber party. We didn't have pillow fights and promised to send each other postcards. Where will we find her? How many times do I have to repeat myself? I, I don't know. I, I did what anyone in my place would do. When I realized I wouldn't be able to help her, patch her up, I called my fixer. Two guys came and picked her up the same day. Who'd you call? Who's your fixer? Wakako. Told her I had a busted doll with a BD implant to hand off. Where did they take her? 
I told you already. I don't know. They weren't the talkative kind, and I'm no gunk. I know better than to ask questions of people like that. You're no gunk? What do you think? Why do all these girls come in here, let you grope around them? Think it's for your charm? Your caring attitude? They do it because they got no choice. And in the end, they despise you. They can smell you pathetic. These guys, what did they look like? Like you, me, anyone else in this city. Really now, they looked like you. They looked like the kind of guys you don't make eye contact with. One of them was a bearded fellow. The two that came for her didn't say anything about where they'd take her, what they were going to do to her. Mentioned something about virtues with a moth, of all things. Said she'd be perfect for them, whatever that means. But that's really all I know. You ponder off like she was some fucking inanimate mannequin. Because that's exactly what she was. Need air. I'll be outside. Judy's right. People like you make this city a living hell. Day in, day out. Got what you wanted, didn't you? So get the fuck out of here! I let her go back to clouds. I could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her. I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey! Keep it together! Wanna give up now? No. Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. Better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Death's Head symbol bring anything to mind. Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This... Industry. I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. Makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. Could be we'll see something to point us in their direction in one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. That's an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City. A domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. Dark net domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van. Hey, yo, man, you trying to rip us off? I got four bags missing here. That's the cut I got off Pablo. Don't like it? Take it up with him. I ain't dealing with Pablo. I'm dealing with you. That means you and me got a problem. Now, I could paint the sidewalk with your guts, but that wouldn't get me what I'm owed. 
Oh, you wanna try? Go on, son! You want to move up in the world, do you? What have you got? Virtues. Any special kind? Well, let me put it to you this way. Those who know, don't need to ask. Looking for BDs. A particular kind. Particular? Give me the best of the best. Ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. How about a discount for your newest customer? Only give regulars discounts. If you're short, then fuck off. Where do you get these scrolls? People that make these? <laughs> Obsessed with privacy. Never even occurred to me to ask where they're from. To which caution I probably owe the fact that I'm still alive, talking to you. I'm no connoisseur, trust me. <laughs> sure. All I need to know is who makes them and where. Now listen, I just sell whatever sells. Nice, calm job. Let me see some eddies, you can pick one. Parse it, and I won't care a hair. Got anything that might interest me? Let me get everything prepped. You make sure the wreath's snug on you. You'll watch while I edit in real time. The old one, too. Ready when you are. No time to lose. We gotta go there. Definitely. Ride with me? Let's get going. On our way. Still can't shake it. That virtue sample we saw with the death said moth. If all they scroll is snuff, then... Stop it. There'd have to be utter gongs to waste her on something like that. What do you mean? We're talking about a girl who's not only a natural at what she does, but also has got a doll's implant. I mean, that's not a package you find lying out in the street. We going in? Find us a way inside. I'll hang back, scan the subnet, see if there's any blueprints of the complex lying around. Join you as soon as I find something. Let's link on Hollow till then. It's not gonna be pretty in there. So? If you mean to tell me to hang back altogether, don't bother. Alright, going in. <laughs> 